Hello and welcome to my channel Study with Pradipto. Today I will discuss week 6 programming assignment 1 of the course programming in Java and in this video I will discuss every programming assignments of this week that is week 6. Now here uh, you will find one progress tab if you click this progress then you will find these three options that is assessment scores, unit wise progress and grading. Now if you click assessment scores then you can see your previous assessment score okay. So this is the score you can see. Now this is the first programming assignment. Now safe division with rule time error handling. Okay, so this is the problem statements. Now read two integers from the user. Divide the first number by the second number inside a try catch block. And if the second number is zero, then print cannot divide by zero. And otherwise print the result. Okay, so this is our task. Now here uh, are two sample test cases. One is test case one 10 by zero, so cannot divide by zero. Now test case two 10 by two, the result is five. Okay, so we have to write the code now. Now here in the program, I have to write system.out.print, then result is, then plus num1 by num2, okay. Now, here I have to click save as draft. Now I have to click compile and run. Now here you can see that 2 by 2 passed, okay. Now you have to click submit button. Now here you will see nothing, okay. I don't know why it is showing nothing, but uh, it is the correct program, okay. Now this is week 6 programming assignment 2, okay. Now programming assignment is nested try catch block. Read two integers from the user inside an outer try catch block perform the following. Inside a nested try catch divide the first number by the second. If division by zero occurs handle it with the inner catch block. And then in the outer catch block handle any other expected errors and print the appropriate messages for each scenario. Now this is the test case. Now the output is division successful result is 5. Okay. Now we have to write the code. First you have to click Java. Then here you will see that the try block is given and catch block that is uh, nested catch block is also given you have to write int result is equal to num1 by num2 now if uh, num1 by num2 is not possible then it will go to the catch block respected catch block and else it will print division successful and the result okay now this is the code now here you have to click save as draft then you have to click compile and run now here you will find that public test cases one by one passed okay then you have to click submit now after clicking submit you will find that the private test cases used for evaluation status is passed now coming to the uh, programming assignment 3. Now in the programming assignment 3 of week 6, this is the problem statement that in Java a try block can be followed by multiple catch blocks to handle different types of errors separately. Okay. Now this is the programming assignment, read two integers from the user inside a try block, divide the first number by the second and handle the arithmetic exception separately to detect the division by zero. Handle any other general errors using another catch block and print suitable message based on the type of error. Now uh, this is the sample test cases. And now uh, 20 by 4 division successful result is 5 now I have to write the code so first I have to click Java then here you will find that the try block is given now here the respected catch block is given that arithmetic exception cannot divide by 0 and uh, if the exception is the other type of exception then uh, it is handled by an except expected uh, sorry unexpected error occurred okay now here I have to write the code inside the try block now I have to write int result is equal to num1 by num2 then in the next line I have to write system dot out dot print ln then division successful right first I have to see this that is division successful now here I have to copy this now in the next line I have to write system dot out dot print then result sorry then the result is then a space then plus result okay then I have to click save as draft then I have to click compile and run now here you will find that the public test cases one by one passed okay then I have to click submit then here you will find that the private test cases used for evaluation is passed now this is programming assignment 4 of week 6 now in this programming assignment we have to use finally in try catch block now, this is the programming assignment, read two integers from the user inside a try block, divide the number, first number by the second, if division by zero occurs, then show an error message and use finally block to print program end date, because finally block will always execute, no matter what happens. Now, this is the test case, 15 and 3, the result is 5, then program end date. Okay, now we have to write the code. Now, here you will see that. In the catch block, the arithmetic exception is there. Like if uh, the division is zero, division by zero occurred, then it will uh, print that cannot divide by zero. And at last of the program, it will also print that program ended every time. Okay. Now here we have to just write in the try catch block 
uh, that system dot out dot print ln then result is then a space then plus num1 by num2 okay then i have to close the bracket so then i have to click save as draft then i have to click compile and run now here you will see that the compilation is fast public test cases one by one passed then i have to click submit now here you will see that private test cases used for evaluation status is passed now coming to the last assignment of this week now this is programming assignment 5 of week 6 now the problem statement is this now create a method called calculate square root now this method reads a number and return its square root okay that means the calculate square root is a method which will return the square root of a particular uh, number now if the number is negative it throws an exception and in the main method you say try catch block to handle the error now this is the test case that is if the input is 16 the output is 4 and suppose the input is minus 16 then it will return that uh, the square root of negative number is not possible okay now here uh, you have to first click java now here you will see that uh, calculate square root so this is the method and uh, public static double calculate square root okay throws an exception now here you have to write throw new exception so we have to throw new exception if the number is less than zero or uh, the number is negative okay so if uh, or if the num is less than zero then i have to write t h r o w throw new exception then i have to write uh, a message okay i can write that negative number okay and if it is not a negative number then it will return math dot sqrt then the number okay then i have to click save as draft then i have to click compile and run now here you will find that the public test cases one by one passed okay then i have to click submit now here you will see that private test cases used for evaluation status is passed. So thank you for watching the video. Please subscribe my channel and press the bell icon. Thank you. See you in the next video.